Did you ever ask yourself why similar looking papers show different properties? For example, kitchen rolls and toilet paper. The reasons for this are chemically paper additives that lend specific properties to paper which they naturally don't have. We show you the difference under wet conditions. On the left side you see wet strengthened paper and on the right side you see unmodified paper. Curita Europe is with its business line paper solutions one of the market leaders for functional paper additives. One of the core products of Curita are the wet strength agents with the trade name Gelatone. Curita produces and sells 80,000 tons of strengths and sizing polymers from Curita's facilities in Europe and Asia. Despite Curita's benchmarking polymer technologies, we furthermore offer tailor-made deposit control solutions and a broad range of process chemicals for paper making. With Curita's pilot paper machine, this video shows the production process of wet strengthened paper. First, cellulose fibers have to be smoothly dispersed in water, allowing the wet strength agent to reach every single fiber surface. Paper production is a non-stop process and storage chests are needed to keep the production continuously running. The liquid wet strength agent is added to the pulp water mixture before a head box. At the head box of the paper machine, 99% water contains only 1% of fiber. On the sieve, the separation of water and fibers takes place, and the wet strength agent should solely stay on the fiber to be effective. The wet paper web with 70% water and 30% fiber is transferred to the press section where further water is removed up to 50% dryness. In the drying cylinder section of the paper machine water is evaporated and the wet strength agent is chemically activated. At the end of the paper machine, the fibers are chemically cross-linked by the wet strength agent. <laughs> 